Hey guys, welcome to our channel. Forsaken Shores bring the whole new area to the map. If you check your map, it's located in the east. The first thing you need to do is sail to Morrow's Peak Outpost. You can buy the new cosmetics from the Kraken and the Ocean Crawler. The Forsaken Ashes cosmetics can be bought with the blooms you can earn by completing commendations. You can only buy the weapons and the ship this week. The other cosmetics will be available later in the event. You can also buy the new Gold Hoarders and Order of Soul Voyages on this outpost. Those new voyages all need to be completed in the new area. You have to complete 5 voyages of each kind to complete 2 commendations. The other commendations are quite easy to accomplish. You only need to visit all the new islands to complete them. You also need to uncover the fate of Captain Morrow's lost crew members. You can check the locations in our other video. You can find the link below the video in description. You don't have any merchant voyages. We think this is because of the lava and the animals simply can't survive on the new islands. Cargo runs are not included yet. They will be out in the third week. If you start to do the voyages, watch out for the volcanoes. When they burst out, you die quick. You must make sure you don't walk into the light colored water when they burst out and don't walk in the geysers or you'll fly up high in the sky and fall back on the ground. The only advantage of them is that if a skeleton walks on them, they also die. Also watch out for the big pieces magma rocks that are flying around. This can make your ship sink very quickly. So make sure to collect enough wooden planks if you're entering the new area. You'll need them. We suggest you to anchor your boat a little further from the island so the volcano can't hit your boat. If you do that, make sure you've collected a rowboat so you can use it to bring yourself and your crew to the erupting island. The rowboats don't get damaged by the water when the volcano erupts, but it can sink by flying rocks. You can find them on random islands and put them on your own ship. Another annoying thing is that when your boat gets hit by something, your rowboat might drop off your ship. The barrel system has also changed in the new update. With one click you can grab the maximum of supplies you can carry. So 5 bananas, 5 wooden planks and 10 cannonballs. From now on you can find quests inside barrels as well. We already told you there is a new storyline in the game during Forsaken Shores. We showed you where to find Captain Morrow and we also discovered the character Jim, where she talked about. You can find him on the island Liar's Backbone. We are curious what his part will be later on in the game. Captain Morrow told us that he betrayed her. He doesn't deny that at all. The only interesting thing he talks about for the moment is a box of wondrous secrets. This seems to be a chest you can discover on random islands and it would be worth 25k. Unfortunately, we didn't have the luck to find one yet. So this was our quick guide through the Forsaken Shores. We hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, don't forget to give us a like. If you'd like to see more videos, make sure to hit that subscribe button. We also recently started our own Discord channel so if you're looking for other crew members or maybe would like to be a part of our crew, feel free to join our Discord channel. You can find the link below the video in description. One last thought of us about the new event is that we think the volcanoes erupt a little too often. This makes it a bit annoying. Don't know what you guys think about it, so let us know in the comments below. Thanks for watching and see you next time!